Hello and welcome to this airport update today of Lakeside International Airport. It's currently very early afternoon and the American carriers are all in their turns ready to go. However, despite this, it's still very busy over at the domestic terminal. First up here at the International Terminal, we have a Singapore Airlines EPS A35900. <laughs> Baggage and cargo is just getting aboard as well as fuel. Catering should be here soon and this is preparing for its flight to Houston. So like Manchester Lakeside sees a Singapore Houston service on a regular basis, as well as their Singapore flight. Next, serving as a reminder of how empty the airport is due to COVID, we have an empty gate. Not empty, however, is uh, gate C4, which is holding United 7879, which uh, is just getting uh, bags and cargo and fuel should be arriving soon for its uh, early afternoon flight to Newark Liberty. So we have a KLM A330-300, which was ready to go. However, due to a passenger uh, who was ill, not being granted boarding, uh, their bags have to be offloaded the plane. So we're expecting a short 15 minute delay for this flight, which is bound for the sunny city in Mexico of Cancun which from the 1st of March will be handed over to be operated by Virgin. Next, we have yet another empty gate. And following that, we have a now empty gate, which has a Delta Boeing 757-200 just pushing back right now for the early afternoon flight to Atlanta Hartsville Jackson International Airport. Uh, Delta operating this in partnership with Virgin Atlantic who have terminated all of their flights outside of their London Heathrow base. Their plan is to start operations to New York and Los Angeles from the 15th of January, then flights to Shanghai and Hong Kong from the 1st of February and all other destinations from the, um, March the 1st. So KLM are currently operating most Central American routes, especially the Caribbean for Virgin. Now hopping over to the domestic satellite, we have two empty gates for um, the regional uh, BA City Flyer flights, which are already on their way. The next is Sand B3, we have a Milan Bergamo based Ryanair 737-800, arrived from Milan Bergamo 30 minutes ago and now it's 10 minutes left and it's 40 minutes turnaround. Uh, baggage and cargo being loaded, some else catering, fuel is done and passengers are just walking out from the terminal now, boarding up for its flight. Next we have a lovely new EasyJet Debs A321 Neo, which is just getting serviced up for a early afternoon, like everything, flight to Tenerife South Airport. Passengers just waiting at the gate. And the much less busy than the previous new aircraft is this EasyJet Airbus A320. Uh, this has no service at the moment. Uh, however, it's meant to go out to Malaga in about four hours and then we'll return to Lakeside for its final leg up to Belfast where it will stay overnight. Next, as we head over to the remote stands, we have a very weird scenario with this Wizz Air Airbus A320. The crew boarded earlier with air stairs, as usual. However, the ground service uh, team had to remove them due to a fault that is unknown. And now they have not been able to return any new ones as there aren't any available for some reason, with many of them being faulty. The Budapest bound passengers are now making their way back to the terminal to wait until stairs are available. However, they are now getting angry with this miscommunication between the crew the airline and the airport staff. Not going to be delayed and running on time is this 737-700 of Ryanair in the special Siemens advertisement, advertisement uh, livery taxiing out for its flight to Faro and like the Milan bound aircraft this is Faro based and will only stay only stayed here it looks like 40 minutes before heading out, back out to its base of Faro. Right next door at the General Aviation Terminal ramp, we have a Avro RJ85 of TNT Cargo, which is just getting some cargo loaded for its flight to TNT's European base at Liège. Now over on the taxiways, we can find another Avro RJ85, this time of Titan Airways, which is operating today for BA City Flyer. It's uh, operating the Belfast City route today. 
Now moving on to runway 08 right, we can find an Embraer 170, which is officially retired. Uh, however, I'm using anyways that have an E190. This is a British Airways City Flyer, which is operating the London City route today. This and the Belfast City route, also from BA City Flyer, operate within five minutes of each other at all times, which makes it easier for the BA City Flyer team based at Lakeside. And now with that being said, we have finished our tour around Lakeside International Airport, located uh, eastern northeast Cumbria. Hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you again for the next video. Goodbye.